Happy Holidays Loves, it's your girl Naturally Naughty here. I'm going to be showing you how to do an easy butterfly halo braid, a beautiful protective style that you can do for this holiday season if you're going somewhere special and you want to do a nice classy hairstyle. So I have my hair cornrowed into two cornrows on either side of my head and as you can see I left two triangular pieces out in the front. That's where we're going to be attaching our braiding hair to. I'm using the Easy Spectra braid from Oh Yes Hair. I have used this hair in a, another video which I'll link at the top right here. Um, but this hair is beautiful, it's amazing, and it's the perfect color. It's red at the bottom, it's an ombre red. So what I'm doing is taking the Spectra Easy braid from Oh Yes Hair and I am attaching one half of one pack to that piece that I left out in the front. That piece that I left out in the front is basically my third leg of my braid. And once I braid down a couple times, I go ahead and split the um, easy braid into three, covering up that third leg and making it longer so we can braid the hair all the way down. So of course we're going to re repeat the same process on the other side. I'm taking the braiding hair and using the um, my real hair as the third leg of the braid to start out. And then once I braid down a couple times, I'm going to split the Spectra Easy Braid into three so it can go ahead and be the third leg of the braid and cover up and lengthen my real hair. And I'm just going to braid it down all the way to the end like normal. Alright, so now for the fun part, we're going to sew these two braids to our real hair. So I'm taking a weaving needle and I'm taking weaving thread that I have already threaded through the needle and tied at the end in a few knots. So I've already started sewing at the top. You're going to start sewing at the top, of course, and work your way down each braid. So what I'm going to do is go up under my real hair, not through the braid, just through the scalp, the braid, whatever. Go through the fake braid. And then I'm going to put the needle through the thread and pull it tight. And I'm just going to repeat that process all the way down until the fake um, braiding hair braid is attached to my head. So as you can see, I'm just threading the needle through my real hair, then through the fake braid, then pulling that needle through the length of the um, thread that's left and just pulling it tight. All right, guys, so please ignore me, Esposo, my husband in the background right here. We were actually getting ready to go somewhere special. We were going to a Christmas gala, and he had to get ready. We were in a rush, so that's why he had to be in these scenes. I was like, I was like, babe, just, just, it's okay. I, I can see you, but just go ahead and get ready because we got places to be. So I have already sewn the first braid down, and as you can see, I'm working on the second braid. And as you can see, I attach the two braids together in the front to give that halo effect so you want to sew the two braids together also because you want them to look like just one continuous braid so i'm just going to repeat the sewing process all the way down this side of my head i'm going to be putting the needle through my real hair through the fake braid and then pulling the needle through the length of the thread and pulling it tight all the way down
To complete this style, guys, all I did was take the two braids that I sewed to my real hair and attach them together with another pack of the braiding hair and then braided that all the way down to create the length for my bun. And then I took the braid that I'm braiding right now, wrapped it into a bun, bobby pinned it in place, and that is the finished look. This style is very easy. And if you're not good at corn rowing, um, it is a great style for you. You can also make the braids bigger by pulling them apart as you saw me doing right there. But I didn't feel the need to do that too much because the braids were quite large on their own as is. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something and I hope you'll try this style for your holiday season. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.